now we are going to see about setting network in CentOS 7 before that we have to check the interface available for that we can use the command network manager nm and command line interface cli space d here you can see the two interface one is loopback and another one is ethernet so we can use Ethernet because loopback is used to check for internal connections and not for outgoing. So now we are using Ethernet. First, let me see about editing using the command line. The path is Vim, etc. Sysconfig network hyphen script and ifcfg and interface name and press enter you can see the type and boot proto default root everything now the boot protocol is dhcp if you want static we have to edit press insert and give static and always make sure that on boot is S if on boot is no the network will fail to start on rebooting the system and now we are going to give the static IP address for that IP ADDR is equal to and giving the local IP address and next the net mask dot zero and next is gateway is equal to one ninety two dot one sixty five sorry 168.5.1 and then DNS and giving Google DNS if you want to give one more DNS rename this DNS 1 and give another name DNS 2 and give another DNS and this is also Google DNS and I have enter for static IP address netmask gateway DNS1 and DNS2 and press escape and colon and WQ sorry WQ must be in small letters WQ that is save and quit now I am going to restart the network has now restarted and you can check the IP using IPA command or if config I'm giving IPA you can see the IP address is set and you can check whether it is accessible to cloud yes you can see the ping result and next is we are going to set the IP address that is network using the text user interface mode for that NM network manager and TUI that is text user interface this is the text user interface and enter edit a connection and you can see the interface available and give the tab and move to edit and press enter here you can see the ethernet now we are going to configure IPv4 so 
select IPv4 and for static you have to give manual if you are going to set DHCP that is dynamic host configuration protocol you can just leave it because it assigns IP address automatically now I am giving static so manual and show now I am giving the IP address I am giving the netmask 24 and the gateway and the DNS and I am giving one more DNS sorry a dot a dot four dot four and next you ok and quit now you can see the IP is set five dot sixty seven and you can check whether it is pinging with Google yes it's pinging thank you